New Mexico State, Grand Canyon. Some would call it a rivalry, others do not. I like to think of it as a rivalry game, even though the Aggies are 10 and 2 all time against the Lopes coming into tonight's game, and that 10th win came in improbable fashion. A half court buzzer beater by Johnny McCants for a two point win, and tonight, well, tonight was the rematch. KTSM 9 Sports on the road with the Aggies as a regular season title was seemingly on the line tonight in Phoenix. An Aggies win would get MSU a two-game lead in the tiebreaker with six conference games to play. We don't miss games like this. The Aggies were pumped. The Havocs, they were there doing their thing as well. One of the best college basketball atmospheres in the country. Early on, it was A.J. Harris, hot hand from outside, three of his 12 points on the night. The Lopes, they would answer with the give and go. Oscar Freyer, the big finish. Later in the half, C.J. Bobbitt, no. Clayton Henry, yes. The putback jam, this game was back and forth the whole way, but here was a big shift in momentum. Eli Chua beats the buzzer at the first half, at the end of the first half, I should say. That gave the Aggies a two-point lead at halftime. Second half, Sean Buchanan off the inbound, finds Trevor and Queen for the dunk. Terrell Brown, he had four big threes in this game as NMSU sweeps Grand Canyon in the regular season once again this year. 67-64 the final. The Aggies have a two-game lead in the WAC with six to play.